Live from Hollywood, California, it's the 90th Annual Academy Awards. Please welcome your host, Jimmy Kimmel. Not tonight. I wanted to deliver the Oscars monologue. The Russian bots did their thing, and here I am. So many great movies this year. I watched Get Out sitting next to Jeff Sessions. The guy wouldn't stop taking notes and smiling like he's in a toothpaste commercial. You know, I actually didn't see Call Me By Your Name. If I wanted to see a lanky boy get screwed on foreign soil, I'd hang out with Jared Kushner. I hope you're happy, Call Me By Your Name. Your trailer killed Billy Graham. I liked The Shape of Water. That fish man had it all. Mute wife, soaks in a bathtub all day, doesn't wake up to exits being widened so staff can quit in groups. Oh, I'm gonna miss my ladybird, Hope Hicks. Anyways, huge fan of Pixar's Coco, or any movie about a bunch of singing and dancing dead Mexicans. But no movie has been more captivating than the one that we feel like we can't wake up from, my presidency. And I announced this week that I'm running again in 2020. <laughs> Thank you, James Woods. Someone put James in a movie. Bridesmaids did for women what his next film will do for dipshits. No, cast my wife, Louise Linton. She can play everything from an upscale doorknob to a load-bearing column. Anyways, tonight, let's also remember those we lost. Take it away, Mikey. Oh, Danny boy. Oh, there's the Harvey. Pipes, the, the big one. I forgot Spacey went this oh, year. Tambor? Did not see that one coming. Brett Ratner absolutely saw that one coming. Louis C.K. went down doing what he loved. James Woods, I just saw him. Makes you think, how much longer do I have? More from the Academy Awards when we return.